Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm spending the day eating nothing but pizza or variations of pizza. <laughs> I was eating pizza a couple of videos ago and someone left a comment saying you should do 24 hours eating pizza. I don't usually do videos where I'm eating like one specific thing. I have in the past like cereal and ice cream and they made me feel so sick but when I thought about pizza I thought there's actually so many variations like how you can make pizza and you can also have sweet pizza savory pizza so i thought this was actually quite a fun one to do and i hope that you guys think so too so yeah if you do enjoy this one please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're new here let's go and see what i make for breakfast right so for breakfast originally i thought about getting Greg's pizza. But then I thought this was a better idea because it's a different variation of how I see people eat pizzas. So, you know, you see people making pita pizzas, pizza wraps, or bagel pizzas. <laughs> I've never tried making them, but I've seen a lot of people make them and they look really good. So for that, I'm literally just gonna like toast it, put some tomato puree on it, put some cheese on it and be done. I was thinking toppings, but for breakfast, nah. These actually look so good. I'm so excited. Do you know what I hate though? Is it looks like I put loads of cheese on. Please excuse my appearance today. It's not going to get much better. I will not be putting makeup on. Um, yeah, it looked like so much cheese, but when it's melted, it's like it doesn't look like that much. Oh my god. Hot, hot, hot. I really want to continue to eat it. For the sake of the roof of my mouth, I'm going to come back to you guys in a minute. I need to let it cool down. Okay, let's try that again. I've tried pita pizzas and wrap pizzas. This is definitely the best combo. Oh. Also, if anyone can please explain the weather in England, that would be fantastic. <laughs> On Friday, there was a massive storm like a tornado and stuff in east london like near my mum and dad's as well but where i live there was nothing there weren't even really any rain it was so weird and it's not like i live that far away do you know what i mean do you know what i need to get guys some like fun games board games but not like nothing like monopoly cluedo actually fun stuff not cards of humanity so yeah if there's any like rogue games where you know it's out of the ordinary then please leave um please leave them below something that doesn't use too much brain power basically because this is me you're talking to final bite I will see you guys for lunch. It's time for lunch and of course I had to include Domino's. Domino's is by far my favourite. I'm sorry, it just is. I feel like I sound like a broken record. Anyway, I've got the usual. Yes. Oh, it's a good oven. Okay, so I always get stuffed crust, barbecue sauce, extra pineapple and ham. And then of course I had to get a mini pizza. And I didn't get a big sauce because, one minute. I use these ones from, what's it called? Don't know. Anyway, like some people say that um, Domino's is like undercooked or mush, what does my brother call it? Soggy, but that's how I like it. I'm trying to think when the last time I had Domino's was, I feel like, ew guys, that looks a bit grim. It's run off. It doesn't smell off, but it's got like a rim on it. Do I eat that? Oh, I probably needed to shake it maybe. Oh well. Yeah, I literally think the last time I had this was when I moved in. Huh? You know what I need to try? Double decadence. I knew about it before, but I never tried it. And then they actually got rid of it. And now they've brought it back. And it's like two thin layers of like base with this sauce in the middle. Love Island actually starts tomorrow. And I'm not gonna lie, I've really missed it. And I feel like because everyone's been locked inside for so long, I feel like this one's gonna be really good. And they've probably all lost their game a bit. Yeah, they're probably all a bit horny. All right. I wonder if they like have to follow social distancing and stuff. 
And also what happens if there's an outbreak of COVID in there? Now that should be so interesting, wouldn't it, if there's an outbreak of COVID? I haven't seen a garlic bread pizza look this good in a long time. They all look that good too, because sometimes maybe they're following people's feedback. Or this person just needs a pay rise, but sometimes they've got too much tomato and it's like, I don't really want tomato, I just want the garlic. That just reminded me of some garlic bread that I ate yesterday, it was so good. I went out for a brunch yesterday for Emma's birthday. I went to Slug and Letter, it's actually so good that one. I'm going to pop you guys in a time lapse so I can enjoy this. Yes, I'm absolutely full to the brim. I've eaten half of this, half of this. My dad's coming around to look at something for me, so he can take this home with him. I'm gonna see if I can get something sweet. Maybe I'll see you before dinner. If I can't get it, then I will see you guys for dinner. Okay guys, so I've just been to Tesco and I managed to get something sweet. <laughs> I thought this was such a sick idea. Literally, looks like the real deal. It's all going off in Tesco, it closes in 20 minutes, everyone's going crazy. I'm so thirsty. But yeah. Um, I managed to think of an idea for dessert, but but on reflection, why am I so dark? But on reflection, I'm like, does it really count? Anyway, I need to rush home, otherwise my mum and dad are going to end up being at mine before me. <laughs> so, I'm going to eat this, shoveling it down quick as I can. Okay guys, it's time for dinner and I'm actually going to get creative and I'm going to make pizza. Kind of creative, actually. <laughs> I've got ready-made pizza bases. Um, I think, I believe these are the ones that Nutty Foodie Fitness uses. And she says that they're better than normal ones. So I thought I'd give these ones a go. Um, they're the gluten-free ones. I got a pizza sauce. Got some mozzarella. Now, do you put the toppings on after or before? I'm going to say put the cheese on and then put the toppings. And then for toppings, I'm just going to put some, like... Um, what is it called? Vegetables. Just some like peppers and onion, I think. Yeah, that's probably it. Just for a little crunch. Let's put it in the oven. This is a good idea, probably not. Ah, fucking hell. I don't want to like burn it too much and then the base is horrible. But it looks good. Whenever I'm in that kitchen, with that oven on, it's so hot. Do you reckon this is gonna to be too hot to eat? The vegetables, I didn't really think about it, but obviously like they, they weren't cooked and usually you would like roast vegetables for longer than, like for over 20 minutes. But obviously this is only in for 15. Okay, right, let's try. Mmm, that base is actually really nice. It's like crispy, it's like perfect amount, it's not too thick. I recently done a little um, Q&A on Instagram and obviously I didn't get to answer all the questions. So I thought I could answer some now, seeing as I've got no brain. Huh, boys were so funny. First one is from a boy. Are you still on that, are we still on for that date? <laughs> How are you? How am I? I'm actually really good, thank you. I know that in this video you're probably thinking something's wrong with me. It's definitely not. <laughs> I haven't had much sleep over the last couple of nights and um, it was Emma's birthday. Emma, who did who I did the Costco video with, just realised I'm wonky, so please apologise. Please, please accept my apologies. <laughs> it's really wonky. I feel like I could fall. Anyway, on her birthday, I put the day off work went to a restaurant and then like I come back edited Sunday's video did all of that did some tidying then went to Emma's went to Emma's and ended up being there till um 5 a.m literally we drank well we opened three bottles of Prosecco but we didn't finish the third and a bottle of wine and we was doing countless amount of shots so basically Mm. There's Di Serrano in a white bottle. And we was mixing, it's the same texture as 
tequila rosé. So we mixed it, half tequila rosé, half that, and it was so good. Oh, new fave shot. And then we went out, out for a birthday yesterday. But how was it? Like, all of a sudden, we looked outside, birds are tweeping. Three, two. I'm starting with a PT this week. Um. I never do anything in the gym apart from class, gym, apart from classes and cardio because I'm too scared to use all the equipment. So I wanted to get a PT that was based in a gym so she could teach me all about the gym so that I felt comfortable in the gym. First session with her is on Wednesday and I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty scared. Kind of, well, that's an update in case anyone cared. Someone said I look like Katniss from Hunger Games. I asked someone this question today. If you could only eat one thing for the rest of your life, what would it be? We both said toast. That you can have different toppings, you can have cheese on toast, you know what I mean? You can have sweet toast, savoury toast, and just toast is just great, plain toast. Oh, actually bread. And then you just toast it, because then you don't have to just toast. <laughs> right. You know sometimes when you're hungover, yeah, and you find something so funny, Final bite, I'm not gonna slice, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty full. I barely answered any questions, I've literally gone off topic as always. Now, like I was saying in the night, when I go to the toilet, sometimes, not all the time, but a lot of the time, like I ain't got far to go, so I walk there with my eyes closed and just sit with my eyes closed. And I was saying, imagine if you went there, you was being burgled. <laughs> And literally, you're just walking out with your eyes closed and there's a burglar in your hallway standing there with your TV just like thinking he's about to be caught, but really, you just walk straight past. And I am not joking, I was cracking up for like an hour after. You know when you just keep laying there and thinking about it and like belly laughing? Oh my God. I've always met with my friend because I've got one friend who like, just like on the same level about everything. I feel like she would understand she hasn't replied yet but listen to how much i'm laughing asking her oh i'm so weird why am i actually sweating probably because i'm full right i'm gonna make this my final bite that was delicious and not too stodgy but i am feeling really full so i'm gonna wait a bit and then i'm gonna make dessert but earlier on i said i don't know if it counts but i've changed my mind in what i'm doing so it definitely is a pizza for dessert it's time for dinner no dessert and um i'm gonna use the other one of these because i'm probably not going to use it otherwise but i am going to cut it and make it smaller because 100 percent I'm not gonna eat a big one. Like, I literally just need a little taste up because I'm <laughs> really full. And yeah, I don't wanna waste chocolate. That's where I draw the line. <laughs> so I'm just gonna make a little mini chocolate dessert pizza. So I think, no, I'm sorry, I know. I'm gonna go for Nutella, because I am a Nutella girl, with some marshmallows, because I feel like that's cute. It will, it will actually feel more like a little pizza with like little toppings on, right? Okay, so I've cut a mini one, and annoyingly, there was a little hole. It was bang smack in the middle. So, yeah. Uh, I'm going to pop this in now, and then I'll add the chocolate in a bit. Okay, here's my mini chocolate pizza. That is cute, isn't it? Sorry, someone is dancing or something downstairs. It sounds hella crazy, right? I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> very sure. I mean, this isn't very exciting. I did want to order chocolate pizza, but to be fair, I didn't actually look anywhere. I did Google it, but nothing come up. I thought Domino's did one, but they didn't have anything on the desserts thing, only ice cream. Obviously, that might just be my one, but I mean, it didn't come up when I Googled it anyway, so. Oh. I'm gonna wrap the video up because I'm not enjoying that, it's really dry. I've probably bored you all to sleep in today's video, so yay, love that for me and love that for you guys. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this one anyway. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next one.